praise Spartan. What's up everybody, Cray is back again. Today I'm gonna share a nice quick little video here for you. And this is actually the map, I believe it's Warlord and of course Halo 2 Anniversary, which I absolutely love Halo 2 Anniversary. And I'm really hoping, I am really hoping that we actually get some more uh, maps for Halo 2 Anniversary. I'm not expecting craziness, you know, or like they, they redo every map. Even though that would be an awesome idea, 3 for 3, pay attention. Pay attention. Would be awesome. Get every map. No, I, I would need just a couple more. At least like uh, Beaver Creek, uh, possibly uh, Turf, uh, Terminal, or Waterworks, or something like that. Maybe a couple big team uh, and a couple small team maps. Uh, Heretic, uh, for those of you guys that like uh, that that map, <laughs> which is uh, probably one of the all-time favorites. I think that would actually make sense. Uh, be nice quick for doubles, but kind of hoping that's going to be the case, but that's not what I really want to talk about today What I actually wanted to say is talk about the MCC insider patch which should be going live I'm believing uh, trust me. It's, it's not verified in any way But I believe the state that it's in now we could probably expect a release uh, to the retail version uh, Soon probably within the next couple weeks and to be honest. It wouldn't surprise me if, there, if it goes live uh, before you even watch this video, uh, I believe it's going to be uploaded by Thursday. So you should be able to check that out uh, then. But it could be another week yet or so. Um, but I do believe it's actually going to be very, very soon. And if you have not been able to participate in the MCC Insider Program, let me just tell you a couple things. Uh, it is absolutely amazing. I love playing the MCC Insider. The only problem I have with it is the very, very limited amount of playlists, but it's understandable. They want to keep everything very concentrated uh, so they can test out whatever it is they're going to test out. So I understand that. Um, the other thing is that uh, <laughs> I can't get on until late, so usually I'm playing with some pretty hardcore players. Uh, those that just love to play Halo and play it all the time. So I kind of get my butt stomped a lot. But I do it for 343 3 and I do it for you guys. I, I get my butt stomped for you guys. Just just so you know. <laughs> but anyways. Uh, and some of the other things that I think you are just going to absolutely love when it does go into the retail version. Is one of the things is I personally I do not have an Xbox one X or an s or anything like that just plain generic Xbox one and The games just look So much better when you go into them. I don't know what it is I think Halo 3 really showcases it off a little bit uh, more than the others uh, but it's just everything just looks a little crisper a little cleaner um, I really wish I could explain it a little better, but the games just look so good. Uh, they look, they're not 4K, but they are definitely look so good. And, and I don't have a 4K TV or anything. It's just 1080p, Xbox One regular, and it just looks so much better. I can't explain it. I don't know why it is, but it is. Um, let's see, what else? Uh, the matchmaking times. Uh, I used to be able to get up and go and grab a beverage or maybe uh, take a little bathroom break or something, you know, <laughs> between matches. Uh, not anymore. Not anymore. Uh, I do. Uh, the matchmaking is very, very quick. And then the load times for the maps is also very, very quick. So those little extra time that you usually are, are used to having between matches, well, that's kind of gone. Uh, which is going to be amazing. I'm hoping it's actually going to be even better. It's going to be even better when it goes into the retail version because the population will be a little bit more. Uh, so it should be a lot better. There you go. One shotgun for you. And one for you. Anybody else want a little shotgun into the face? <laughs> oh, man. I'm just saying, it, it's coming out soon. And I think, personally, I think it's going to really increase the population a little bit. Uh, I'm not going to say like Halo 3 days is going to return. Uh, no, no, I don't say, see that happening by any means, by any means. But 
I do believe the population will increase and be a lot more steady and and could be a lot more fair when you are playing with the uh, friends online because it's going to be a lot more people to choose from for the system to match stuff up. So I'm thinking that's going to be the case. Uh, I don't think it's ever going to be Halo 3 days again because that was just such a unique time frame in gaming history because Halo was so unique and there was not a whole lot of options out there and there was few but you're, you're just not going to see that anymore um, but still it's still it, it's still going to be uh, incredibly fun and I definitely recommend it if you haven't got MCC at this point uh, it's definitely going to be worth it here very very soon uh, it's going to have all them hiccups just kind of be taken out and you won't even ever have to experience that again. But anyways, thanks again for watching guys. By the way, I was playing with Elite Assassin. Always fun to play with. Catch you next time. Comment, like, and 